I know a lot, but there's some things I don't know. Don't know no ugly bitch. Don't know no broke niggas. Don't know no snitch niggas. Hey guys, this is Matt today with another video. Well, in this video, I will be showing you guys how to uh, fix your Gary's Mod problem when it comes to trying to play with friends on a private server. So basically, Gary's Mod has never thought of patching this clearly because, like, now as of 2016, it's still a problem. So let me go ahead and bring up the error there. Hold on, guys, I got memory. Okay, here we go. Let's hope this pops up in a flash. <laughs> it's probably not. I don't know why. But anyway, you get the key what I'm talking about. So basically, this problem is still occurring, and I found the way of how I patched it. So first of all, what I use to patch my problem is you know how Steam um, has a problem when it comes to going off uh, friends, and uh, you try to play with your friend on through Steam. So technically what I would do since this is clearly not patched I will uh, I download a tongue glow. here's the download I will I will put the download in the description so for you guys sakes because I know you guys like downloads and stuff so I will put the download in the description because I am Google Google as fuck <laughs> but yeah all right so once uh, your tongue glow is done downloading go ahead and install it and it will ask you to install the adapter agree to that please because if you don't have the adapter uh, tongue will not work right and it was a pain in the ass for it to install correctly so when you install that adapter well, let me see if I can find that adapter it's, that got to be it or it could be well yeah that's it so that's the adapter it will say tap window 32 adapter v9 tongue so this adapter will install through installation it's a safe adapter I downloaded it and right now it's not being used well, once your tongue glow is done downloading, hold on guys. All right, yeah. Once your tongue glow is done downloading, go ahead and, and make an account with it. it. Like the first time you open, it, it's gonna ask you to make an account. Of course, you say yes, 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 to all. And um, you will need to put a valid email because tongue glow sends your password to your email. You can't make your own password, so tongue glow sends to email. Once all that is done, go ahead and open up Tangelo, let it do its thing, and you will log in. So you will have a virtual IP logged in as whatever your username is. So you will also, so basically, uh, this is thing right here. It's a home start page in the private networks. Private networks is available to all, basically, to premium users for sure, and the basic users as well. So when you get click the private networks, you will have to activate it by it will, it will be a little page here talking about um, activate something like that to make sure you're not a bot or something. And it will take you to whatever your browser is Google, Mozilla, Internet Explorer. It will take you out of the, it will take you to it, and you will click activate on the browser. So basically, once your browser is set up, well, once your this is unlocked, you will type in network type basic and your network name. This name will need to be something memorable or that copy and paste so you can send to your friend. He will paste it in the um, network name button. And if you uh, and if you put a password, he will need the password and make sure your network range is set to standard. So it will create it will create the network. Hold up guys. Still trying to create. It did it did it. Alright, so once your um thing is up, the network this will it will pop up like this with a little box saying that your network is a private network. No one knows about it except you until your friend list. You, when your friend makes an account, make sure he remembers his name. Um, turn on the offline. And this is how you will add him. See, this is my friend list. Like your friend will like possibly Skype. He will send you his name through Skype. And you click add contact to type in the contact name. Like here's an example. It's going to search it. It's probably not going to find nothing because it's like that's a weird name. Hello one two three. Who fuck makes a name with that? But I mean, people do do it. But it's gonna find it, and like, it, if it's right, it will find it. And then you just click add cunt, and then your friend will get it, and he will accept the friend request, and he will appear green over here. Like this is my friend list. I have like uh, a good bit of friends over here. So.
So anyway, as that searches, I'm gonna exit that out because you know stay tuned. And anyway, there it goes with me. And basically, this is how I do it. So once your clinic is open, all you have to do is shrink tungle, go on Steam, and basically the same route that you do when it comes to playing the game. You open up the game, the game that you like to play, like lane play, Gary's mod, lane play, click play, and um, once you are on Gary's mod, go to multiplayer and lane. Like legacy browser, multiplayer uh, lane. And what it will do is that instead of being a public match, it will be a private lane connection, and only people in your lobby on Tunglo will be able to see it. If they don't see it, you may have a connection problem. Like my connection is unable, it's closed right now. Actually, it's not closed, but people can still connect to me. It's just that it's not like 6G fast as hell. It's like really like medium connection and like you also will need a, like a good connection if you plan to be a host and it, it's not best for you to record while you're hosting because it will lag your connection and possibly mess it up so hope this guys hope this helps you and uh, any way possible like subscribe for more of course I love making videos like this for you guys to help you through your little problems that you may be having with your mod. and if you do want to possibly um, be in one of my Gary's mod videos that I plan to be dropping sooner or later let me know. Like you can leave a comment on my videos in so my comment section on my videos. Don't be blowing up like um crazy. Or you can also find me uh, through Steam because my Steam link link is linked on to my YouTube channel. Oh, I'm on DJ Kelly. It's like looked, hooked onto my channel thing and like right there. So if you um do want to get in contact with me, it's like open three like options and stuff. And I'm not sure if I dropped my personal information on here. I probably didn't. But you can also contact me through Roblox if you would like to, and Steam, or Google Plus. Google Plus is really, I don't recommend, but yeah, it just happens. But like.